the other day, Esther said to Jerry, they were in San Diego and they were on a beautiful space. They'd been enjoying it for quite some time. And it was the day that they would take the entire rig and move it to Malibu. And they were looking forward to Malibu, but they were very comfortable where they were. And the satellite dish was up, and Esther was answering email, and they were very contented, and they have friendly neighbors. And Esther was feeling like she could just sit there all day. And then suddenly, she got an impulse to go. And she said to Jerry, I don't know why, but I have such an impulse that we should go. And Jerry said, all right, we should follow your impulse. And then something came up, and she set that aside, and she decided to do this, and just one more thing. And instead of following that impulse, which didn't feel urgent, it just felt like an impulse, they delayed for another hour and got caught in a very bad traffic jam, where if they had left when Esther's impulse was there, they would have avoided that altogether. And mm -hmm. it's quite fun to see the evidence of what the impulse was about, in other words, all that does is make them more determined that they will follow their impulses more specifically. But what we're getting at is when you get tuned in, tapped in, turned on, and when you use your mind and your powers of visualization and your ability to line up energy as the method that you create with, and then you just follow through with inspired action, what happens is the universe yields back to you so much more time.